Jurassic World, powered by Eggman's. What is up guys, Milak here, and today we are back in action playing some Jurassic World. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to go and click the like button, I'd really appreciate it, and it helped me out tremendously. So, I've been working on the base a little bit, guys. And uh, as you see, we have a little bridge. Uh, I've been working on the, I guess, the retaining wall right here. And uh, we got some little things right here. This is actually going to change, but I ju just wanted to kind of give you guys a little, uh, a little view of what it looks like so far. So here's the bridge. It has some wooden supports underneath. And then we're actually probably going to use some carpenter blocks for half slabs right there. And then maybe some fencing across, maybe some cobblestone fencing or something like that. I'm still kind of uh, trying to think of ideas for it. But we got the wall in the front. Uh, we still need to, I think I'm going to put two towers on each side right here. So we'll have a tower right here and then a tower on the other side. I haven't got to that point yet. Um, I'm not sure how big the towers are going to be either. But this is actually perfectly in the center of our smelty right here. So this room up here is going to be in the center of the base. Now what I was thinking for right here, uh, we can do some of this action. Let's go ahead and do some uh, some wood action. And then I was thinking we can put some water wheels right here in between and have some water going over it. And that'd be kind of cool. So uh, we're going to go ahead and start doing that. Let me go over here and grab some glass real quick. Let's see, so we got some glass. I'm gonna go and turn all these into bottles. Let's see, we'll make, we'll make 15 bottles right there. And then I'm gonna come over here to the, the things and we're gonna go ahead and bottle a bunch of the creosote oil up. Let's go ahead and uh, boom, there we go. So we got 10 bottles, nice. So let's go ahead and get the rest of this right here. Uh, we don't have quite enough. Let's go ahead and make a little bit more balls. You know, this actually makes more creosote than I thought it did. Also, I got some suggestions, uh, let's see, for uh, these guys right here um, <laughs> Someone said the more lava you put around them the more uh, RF predict they actually produce Also, we can grab the cold coke out of this right here And then we can uh, stick the cold coke directly into uh, these guys and it produces a lot of lava and produces more RF a tick So these guys are actually viable. So I might actually set up a bunch of these uh, Somewhere, but for now, we're just going to kind of keep them like that. There we go. So we have uh, it looks like 20 bottles of stuff. Let's go ahead and turn all of this into um, into wood. Let's see, what else can we use this for? So we can make treated wood. Uh, looks like we can also, I think you can use creosote as a fuel source as well. I'm not sure about in this, but I think you can. Let's go ahead and stick all these guys in here. I'm gonna stick the wood in here. And then we are going to grab, not that, uh, this. And let's go ahead and make some stuff. Let's see, so boom, uh, we got eight. Let's turn all this into treated wood, and then let's go ahead and get some more. Let's see, boom, let's get eight more. There we go. Get some more treated wood, and then we are going to get a little bit more of treated wood. So this should be plenty of treated wood to actually make everything that we need. And this wasn't quite as bad as what I thought. For some reason, my area here kind of chunk loaded off camera, so that was a little thing. Also, uh, I just want to thank you guys for all the support you've brought to the series so far. It's uh, it's been pretty awesome. Uh, it's 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 been really cool. So, uh, we want to do water wheels. So for water wheels, we need this. Let's go ahead and make a bunch of these guys. So we have 16, which is enough for four. But we need lots. We actually might need a lot more of this as well. Uh, so let's just go ahead and do a little bit of this action. Oh, I did not mean to do that. But we have four of these. Nice. Go ahead and make some more, and then let's make some more water wheels. Boom, boom. we have six. That's enough for uh, two complete water wheels. Um, let's turn half of this into sticks again. Let's see, let's turn even more of this into sticks. There we go. Uh, boom, and then we will make a little bit more. There we go, three. Oh, I'm out of wood now. Okay, so we need more creosote, so that means we need to wait for this to do something. So the only bad thing about this is this guy fills up completely with creosote, then it starts making stuff. So we need to actually find a way to pipe the cre creosote out of here and maybe put it in like a container or something. Um, we'll worry about maybe at the, the, about that maybe at the end of the episode here. We also need to make, let's see, what are these things called? Uh, not that. Is yeah, the kinetic dynamo. So this requires a copper wire core, I think. I think this is what we need. We need the kinetic dynamo, maybe? 
Uh, we can also make the external heater, which we can use to power furnaces, uh, but I'm not really too worried about that for right now. But yeah, we need the copper wire core, which needs uh, copper ingots and bamboo. So let me go ahead and make all of this stuff. Okay, so I might have lit, I went a little overboard with that, but uh, it's fine. <laughs> I went a little overboard with it, but it's, it's perfectly all right. So let's just go ahead and make... Uh, 11? Sure, why not? I might not need that many, but uh, now we need iron and we need redstone. I have a little bit of redstone, so let's go ahead and do this. Boom, kinetic dynamo. We shall make, let's see, we need one, two, three, and four. I think we need four. Let's see, one, two, three. Yeah, we need four of these guys. So I'm going to go ahead and just put the rest of this stuff up. Let's go ahead and throw all this in here, and then I'll throw the redstone in here, and we'll go ahead and grab this. There we go. Uh, so now we got to figure out where we want to stick this stuff. Let me grab. Uh, let me let me go get a little bit more wood here, and then we also need a little bit of food. Let's see, wood, and then food. Where is our food? We have a little bit of apples, not too many apples, but uh, that is fine. Okay, so. Um, now we got to figure out how we want to do this. So this needs a three by three area. I think uh, Let's see. I think it's three blocks wide. Maybe um, so we want to Maybe kill no we probably want to stick this maybe down one here. There we go So what about can it fit right here? There we go. So it can oh it looks like it's inside of this a little bit. Hmm Hmm is, it, is that fine that it goes inside of it? Or is that going to look really weird? Let's go ahead and stick this on here, then get back up top and kind of take a look at it. Ah, that might be a little weird. Yeah, that might be a little weird. We might want to have a little bit more room around it. Uh, so, yeah, we'll bring this out one more. Let me go ahead and kill this guy. Let me kill this guy. And then we'll bring this out. Let's see. Eh, there we go. And then there we go. And then, eh, one, two, eh, and then three. Okay, so this is exactly the way I want it to be. Let's go ahead and get back up top and then take a look at it. So I was thinking about doing this except for all along the front right here. Then we need to have water go over top of it to actually cause it to spin. And then we can do some kind of like cool fountain thing. I'm not exactly sure how we're going to do that, but uh, it can just be some kind of cool little fountain thing. Yeah, so this is perfect actually. This is perfect. Okay, um, so maybe right here we want to have like a little wall blocking it, something like that. And then for right here, we can do something like this. No, no, we want to be able to see it, right? Yeah, I think we want to be able to see it. So let me go ahead and do this. And then we're going to stick uh, these other guys. Oh, can they not? Oh, so we're going to need more, aren't we? Yeah, we're going to need definitely a lot more. Let's go ahead and do this and then stick this guy right in here, right? Yeah, right there. And we'll go ahead and do three more. And then I think this will look cool. Hopefully this looks cool. Wait, why can't I do this? Me, let me get right here. Two and then three. Oh yeah, this is gonna look awesome. This is definitely gonna look awesome. So do we want the water to flow this way or do we want the water to flow this way? I'm not exactly sure. We It'd be kind of cool if we had like a fountain come down and flow over top of this. Let me work on it a little bit and I'll be, I'll be right back. Okay, we're back. So I've been doing a little bit of work. We have some water channels underneath of it. Let's hop down real quick. Uh, so the plan is to have the water flow from the top, go in behind it and flow all the way down. I think it will look pretty sweet when it's done. Um, I have the water wheels this place right there, and I have all the water channels done on this side. I haven't done anything on that side yet just because uh, how slow the freaking uh, wood is to get. I can't really make the water wheels fast enough. But uh, let's go ahead and jump up here. Let's place the water and then see how it looks. I think it'll look really cool. Let's go ahead and jump. Uh, uh, there we go. Now let's go ahead and get up here. And then let me place down the water thing. And we'll place it right here. And we're going to go ahead and stick water here. Now, my problem is I don't know if it's going to flow. Yeah, it's flowing sideways, which we don't necessarily want. Uh, hmm. And then also, what happens if I kill this right here? It flows weird. Okay, so... Uh, we're going to have to do something about this. Let's just go ahead and place this guy, like, right here. We'll, we'll do some, like, weird, weird uh, water action. Uh, <laughs> let's see. Oh, no, we do not want to block that. Ah, oh, man, this is so strange. Uh, we'll do, we'll put that there. And then this will flow down, I guess. Let's go ahead and come over here. And then we're going to do a little bit of this. And then if I do this right here, let's see, boom. Let me kill all these guys right here. Then maybe we'll have, like, this thing connect up like this yeah maybe maybe this will work i'm not exactly sure i'm just kind of playing with ideas right now eh, there we go 
and then we can oh no get up we can connect these guys all the way across and look it's turning it's turning yes that's exactly what we want now i wish i didn't have to do this right here and i could like do some kind of weird water mechanics to where it doesn't like flow off but uh it's fine let's just go ahead and kill all these guys right here eh. let's kill all of these guys and then we need to do some of this action is that down like that yeah yeah this is what it looks like and then i like how you can actually jump on top of this what i want to know is if i jump on this no, okay, so it doesn't actually move me. I was thinking maybe it would move me or something, but no, it doesn't. Uh, come on. Uh, actually, we need to place these other water wheels as well. Let me go ahead and jump down here and then do a little... Why? So, I have, like, some ghost water wheels right here. I'm not sure. So, if I do that and then if I do that... Yeah, there we go. And then this guy right here. So, I have two more water wheels left. And this guy does flow all the way down exactly the way I want it to. We need to uh, get rid of that guy. There we go. And it's flowing perfectly. Okay, so this is awesome right here. This is freaking awesome. Okay, so now we're back up here. Let's go ahead and jump all the way up to the top. Let's get this and then let us make it flow all the way around. Now, if I come right here, is this flowing? Oh, nope, that is not what I want to do. What is it doing? Oh, okay, I see. I see. Let us uh, block this guy right there and then that guy right there, then that guy right there. Something like this. See, now this is like blocking everything from view, which is not what I want, but, uh, you know, actually from right here, this actually, this doesn't look that bad. Let's see. No, that doesn't look bad at all. So now what I need to do is I need to make, uh, some connectors and then some wires. Then we can actually hook the power up to over where our stuff is. So let me work on that and I will be right back. Actually, speaking of that, uh, I've been making some steel and I've actually melted a bunch of steel down right here. There we go. So we have 45, uh ingots i guess um and then now we're about to have some more still okay so off camera i've been doing some stuff i went mining for maybe a couple hours i got some gold and i've been doing some stuff so i what i want to do is i want to go ahead and upgrade our pickaxe and our sword to steel and maybe even our shovel so let's just go ahead and get the parts required there we go boom 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 and then i'm gonna get another one of these guys and then i'm gonna get a uh a full guard and then let's see let me put this guy back and then we want to get a sword blade let me go ahead and put this guy back so boom and then let's go ahead and get these guys and then i'm gonna get a shovel let's go ahead and do this boom and then get a shovel i'm gonna go ahead and just replace all my tools and you know what i might as well just get an axe as well uh so let me go ahead and find the axe where is the axe at there we go uh, get this guy boom and then we want a couple more of these guys as well okay so we have everything we need oh and i'm completely filled uh, <laughs> well that's fine let's go ahead and repair our tools boom it is repaired now let's uh, stick our new stuff on here nope that is not what i want that is what i want so it goes from let's see mining level iron to mining level redstone repair material uh steel and it has a lot more durability as well so let's just go ahead and replace all of the pots Boom, there we go. So we have a steel pickaxe. We want to uh, repair this guy as well. Let me go ahead and stick the, him in there. And then we want to do sword, uh, god, and then uh, one of these guys. Boom, there we go. So we, now we have a steel broadsword. Uh, let's go ahead and repair our axe. And we want a little bit of a better axe. And this also gives us increased mining speed as well, uh, which is good. Uh, boom, okay. And so, yeah, full steel tools is going to be way better than um, iron tool tools. Uh, we mine faster, we have more durability, and we can have higher mining as well. Uh, and then, did I... I didn't... Uh, do I need another one of these guys? Yeah, I need another one of these guys. Okay. So, boom, and then boom, there we go. So, we have a full steel set, which is awesome. How much durability does this have? 415. Uh, that is definitely more. I think uh, iron was like 250, something like that. Um, okay, so let's go ahead. What I want to... Uh, uh, there we go. What I wanted to make is a... Uh, I want to make a pulverizer. So let's just go ahead and make this guy. Boom. Uh, we want two of these. Two machine uh, frames. So I want a furnace. And then I also want a pulverizer. Let's go ahead and uh, get this. I got everything prepared. I'm actually prepared for once, which is good. Oh, I need a piston. Let's get the piston. I am missing one of these guys right here. There we go. Uh, boom. And, uh, you know, I was actually surprised I was able to mine uh, gold. But I was able to mine gold with my iron pickaxe, which is pretty good. Let's just go ahead and stick this guy. We'll stick these guys right here for now. 
We go ahead and disable everything. Boom, boom. And then we want to take uh, some cables, route it along the backside. I'm going to show you guys exactly why we want to do this. Or We actually need a pulverizer right now. I'm going to show you why here in a second. Let me get some of these guys. Ah, what are you? Ah, spider, get out of here, bro. There we go. Also, I got all the water things done and all of the, the things for that one side. So that's good. Let's see, boom. We got this now. Let's go ahead and pulverize some gold. Let's see, is this filling up with energy? Oh, wow, this is this is bad. Uh, and then we want to get, uh, let's see, eight of silver, too. So what we're doing is making electrum. So I'm going to go ahead and pulverize these guys. And then uh, we're going to combine them and then smelt them down. And we'll get electrum. The reason we need electrum is to actually make all the other uh, pieces uh, to do this. Because I want to do medium voltage. I could do low voltage right now, but I figured we might as well just go ahead and do medium voltage. Uh, we could also do high, but it requires a lot of steel, and I don't really have that much steel right now. I think it might be a little overkill, so we're not going to really worry about it. Okay, so I went ahead and pulverized all the gold and silver. Let's stick all this up here. So I get some Electrum. We got two Electrum, and then you just stick it in here, and it smelts down. And I put cold Coke in every single one of these guys, so it gave me an instant boost of power, but I used like almost all of my freaking cold Coke. But yeah, there we go. We got a crap ton of Electrum now. And what I want to do is we want to make a bunch of wires. So let me let me make a bunch of these guys. Four, and then six. Yeah, we'll make six. Sure, why not? And this is going to make a bunch of electrum wire, wire co coils. We'll probably end up using every single one of these. I'll actually probably end up need, needing more. But I also want to make, let's see, we need some redstone, right? So let's go ahead and make some redstone. Five. Uh, we're going to make five of these uh, capacitors right here. Oh, I need some more iron, don't I? Uh, let me, did all my iron smelt down? Uh, yes, we have a bunch of iron. Let me go ahead and get all of this iron. Let's see, do I have any in here? Nope, I have used all of my iron. Um, also, <laughs> we want to make these guys, these MV wire connectors, uh, which requires iron and hardened clay. I already have the hardened clay somewhere. Let's see. Yeah, there's my hardened clay. Awesome. I went out and grabbed some. Boom, treated wood. Awesome. Okay, so <laughs> now, now do we have, okay, so we want five. I'm going to make five of these guys. We're going to need more, um, and they hold a million RF a piece, actually, uh, but we want to stick all these guys as, like, little buffering stations, and I thought that'd be kind of cool to mass a large amount of energy while we're offline and do stuff like that, and then we want a bunch of these guys, so I'm going to make, let's see, one, two, three, four, we'll make 32 of these guys. That should be plenty. And then, what are we missing to actually make more envy capacitors? Uh, we have, oh, we're missing the redstone. I don't have the redstone, dang it. Uh, but yeah, anyways, that's all I want to do for today. Next time, we will probably hook these guys up. I've been working on this episode for like six hours now, so I'm freaking tired. Um, you can ask Alien. He's been on this uh, thing the entire time I've been on here. And I've been, like, mining and then working on building and doing all kinds of cool stuff. But I think it looks really cool. I I'm really happy with it. Now, we are going to be copying this design over on the right side. And I think once it's all said and done, it's going to be sweet. Now, up above this is going to be a walkway. And then probably inlaid will be windows. So you have a walkway right above here, then windows behind it. So I think once this whole like castle front here is done you guys can kind of start to get a picture of what this looks like and then i think i want to do some towers over on the left and right and then maybe in, even in the back and stuff too i'm kind of making this up as i go along so as i build i get more and more ideas anyways if you guys like the design you know make sure to go and click the like button i'd really appreciate it um, i love y'all's faces and i'll see you guys in the next one